Hi you guys, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel I should say. Um, I'm doing this a little bit later in the day. It's been a bit of a hectic, crazy week. Good and challenging at the same time. <laughs> um, this is the daily telepathy for those of you that identify with the Twin Flame Connection. Uh, welcome to those of you new just tuning in. Um, thank you guys so much for all your likes, subscribe, sharing, and subscribing to the channel. I really do appreciate it. So since this is general, it's not going to resonate with every twin flame out there. So please keep that in mind if you start to get confused or, you know, um, it's not resonating with you. It's just not your reading. It's not going to resonate with everyone. I do offer personal readings. So if you're interested in booking one of those with me, that information is going to be below in the description while wow, cards are popping out already. I'm just going to show you um, hamster wheel surviving daily hustle so this could be about money or could just be doing that um, daily hustle that grind um, and that could be um, the masculine wanting to come out to let you know that it could be the feminine as well male or female okay so again um, all the decks i'll be using here are going to be below the video in the description as well as all the items you see here are below I'm using the love, love Letter Candle for manifestation of this reading. Um, and uh, that's below in my Instagram information. So there will be an extended version to this video. So if you are interested, you can join me on Patreon. That link is below. Okay. It says view, um, join or view, extend it. Okay. All right. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is get the energy surrounding... Um, your twin towards you, um, divine masculine and divine masculine, I mean, divine feminine and your shared energy. Okay. Even if you hear me say he or she, I'm still referring to energies and not a specific gender. Okay. So let's go ahead and get started. Please excuse my nails. I know they're jacked up, but I haven't had time to do anything about it this week. And it's just been just absolutely insane week. All right, so this is the romance angels. This is the energy that masculine is in towards the feminine. Look at that, true love. This is the romance of a lifetime. So that is a really beautiful energy. The masculine is in towards the feminine. And then um, feminine's energy towards the masculine. Trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith. So the feminine is already in this energy. I'm feeling for the most of the ones that um, is resonating so far. Um, but for those of you that are not, this is um, spirit saying to have trust in this situation. This, you know, it's asking for you to have faith. And then your shared energy is keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. So this can mean, you know, a couple of things. It can mean that. You know, this person is completely different from what um, you're used to dealing with, okay? was well, not your normal type, okay? And then also that because of that reason, keep an open mind because they may do things differently from how you do things. They have may have a set way that they do things. So sometimes we as, you know, human beings and it's uh, perfectly normal and natural to do, we expect people to... Be kind of like you know us um i know me as virgo is very challenging <laughs> to try to not expect people to be like on the same page as me um you know because i'm pretty loyal um to people and and if they're not that same energy you know it's, it's a completely um it, and it does mean like they have to be um it's not like like I want him to be a hundred percent, not ninety nine, you know, point five or whatever. So I don't know. I guess we can be a little bit harsh. <laughs> so, anyways, let's go ahead. This is my situations deck. Um, this is available below as well. If you live in the United States, you can order from my site or my Etsy shop. But if you're international, interested in either of my decks, please send me an email and I will send you a link to order. So let's get some more energies. That this masculine wants to talk about or is in towards the feminine so we have a realization awareness finding out coming to light so there's some kind of recent discovery that this masculine has come to when it comes to this connection and it could be about realizing that this feminine is um, his true love
And then we have racing, running, avoiding. So he could also be realizing that he's been running and avoiding, you know, something that he really wants, this true love, this energy. So this is something he could have come to terms just, you know, recently. And then we have nightlife, gamble, take a risk, Vegas, okay? So some of you like this could have to do with, you know, things that go on in the night, you know, casinos, nightclubs, restaurant bars. Um, this is an energy of, you know, you know, gambling, taking a risk. It also says Vegas here. So it could have to do with like, you know, that nightlife, that hotel entertainment, you know, type of energy. So for some of you, I'm picking this up. This could just be a side message that your the masculine has realized you've been avoiding them. OK, you've been avoiding them. Um, and some kind of way, maybe some of you are tied in a workplace and they may have came to some type of realization that you've been trying to avoid them, you know, maybe to not be triggered. Um, that's also what I'm getting here. Then we have alien, so telepathic dreams, songs. So for some of you that work with this person, I feel like they've been getting um, these signs in that environment that they work with because I'm just picking up like um, a heavy energy for some people that work in that kind of environment in the nightlife. And your person is being connected uh, being reminded about you through um, songs is what I'm getting mostly. It could be about dreams, but I feel like they're being connected through music being playing, uh, playing um, in these uh, environments. And your person may be starting to realize that, you know, through this, it has helped them realize um, how much they care for you, that you're there, you're, uh, you're their true love. And one more. We have access granted. Okay, so they have gained access to some type of information uh, regarding you, or this could be that realization in uh, energy. Um, they could also have done this through social media. You know, some could have created a fake profile, but they're hiding. However, way it is, you know, they could be hiding under a fake profile, or even if the fake pro it's not a fake profile, they're just using like a different username so you don't really know who that person is not like they're fake but they're just using a username and you know not everybody is being um a fake when they have a username um they just don't you know have their username so i feel like this is being connected um through the 5d as well that you guys are being you're you're connecting um and this also could have helped your the masculine realize this connection, okay? Because you're both your shared energy is keeping an open mind. So the masculine is also keeping an open mind to that. You know, for him it could be that he could be involved with someone else um, as well. There's a few people there in the shared energy, and he could be involved with a, another person, and. Um, the person that he was with, maybe realizing that they 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 differ from what he wants, if that makes sense. I was trying to summarize that, but that's the best way I could explain it. Um, this is my uh, twin flame messages. This is also available below in the description. Oh, I want to tell you guys something really quick before I go on. Um, I'm super excited. I'm not going to go on too much about it, but I have created my third deck. And I'm waiting for that to come in. So since this is the daily tea or the daily telepathy, I wanted to go ahead and let you guys know about that. So I'm super excited. I'll be talking about it soon. Um, and then um, when I get here, of course, then I'll be more talking about it. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and get um, some messages from your divine masculine to you around these situations. Why is this realization here? Your intuition is right. 
So you're a person, and we have this alien uh, telepathic. You you guys are connected. So there's some kind of energy where your person, um, the divine masculine, realized that you were right all along. Your intuition was right with the type of connection this is. Also that it'd been running and avoiding, you know, taking a risk. I feel like that um, is also saying that. And also I created this card too, like whatever... You know, I said prior to or we're thinking is kind of like a confirmation from spirit. This also could be if you were thinking a certain thing while I was doing this. This is spirit telling you that your intuition is right. So let's get some more about this racing. I don't know how to approach you. So your your person has been running and avoiding you because they don't know how to approach you. So you could have done this as well. You could have avoided them as well because you, you didn't know how to approach them. So you're just trying to like, you know, keep your distance. But if it's you that's been keeping this distance, it's helping this masculine um, to realize um, this connection, this true love connection. And why is the nightlife here? I've changed. So your person is wanting to let you know that they've changed. Okay, so maybe before they weren't willing to do this because the running is um, next to this taking a um, the nightlife take a risk energy. So maybe before they weren't willing to take a risk, but now they're starting to have this energy where they're they're changing their uh, um, their mind because they see you as their true love now. Okay. So let's get some more about this alien here. I want to escape with you. So you both could be getting connection, um, you know, connected in the 5D with this energy. Um, your person is wanting to escape. We have this running and avoiding. Um, so there's that realization. Um, I feel that your person has been avoiding the fact that they do really want this. They want to escape with you. Maybe they're going through some kind of tension or problems in their life and they're wanting to get away um, like a little trip or something like that. And why is the access granted here? You resonate with my soul. So they have realized this. This is why they know you're their true love. You resonate with their soul. This is just as simple as that. They've had, I think... This is what they've been hiding, okay? They've been, uh, I feel like that's what it is. They've been hiding this, running, avoiding. Um, and there's a realization about this, that they haven't been wanting to take a risk towards this, you know, for whatever reason. Maybe they were hurt in the past, you know, when it comes to love. So I'm going to look at the bottom of these cards um, before I go over to the extended again, if you're interested. That information is going to be below in the description. Um, I'm going to go a little bit further into what this realization was about and um, a little bit more about how come they don't know how to approach you if that's going to change or anything and what may have been coming through through this um, telepathic dreams or songs like why is that alien card there and a little bit more about this access granite what else they've been granting, getting access to. So we have healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So some of them could be involved, you know, um, with parents that, you know, maybe were not supportive or maybe some, you know, both weren't there or one or the other wasn't there. And your person could be um, healing that or it could be involved around children um, as well. And we have crickets silence non-action so your person in the past i feel like they didn't take any action towards healing the situation if you guys don't have a family or this doesn't have to do with parents they could be seeing you as their family and they didn't take any action to fix this okay and there's a realization about this that they've been running and avoiding doing anything about this connection See, losing sleep over you. So I feel like they've been losing sleep over you because they didn't do anything about this connection. 
That's what I feel the main energy is. They didn't do anything. They didn't try to heal it. They didn't try to fix it. Instead of they just ran and avoided the connection. So that's the main energy I'm getting here. Okay. All right, you guys. So I hope that resonated with you. If it did, um, please like. Also subscribe if you are new to the channel, please. And um, I want to thank each and every one of you for watching. Have a good day or night, whatever it is, wherever you are. And until next time, next video. Peace, love, and light.